Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. <laughs> this is a good word. And it's really good. It's really, 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 really a good prophetic word. Now, um, okay, I'll go ahead and explain and and then I'm going to say what I wanted to say. Because if I start by saying it, it's not going to make any sense to you right now. Shalom, the Lord bless you. I welcome you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. God bless you in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The title of this particular word says, Somebody is about to say this to you and it has never happened. Somebody is about to say this to you and it has never happened. It's, this is about to be history okay it's about to be history to you it's because it's so different honey it's it's wonderful it's amazing and it has never happened i'm speaking right now and somebody's losing patience the person's like can you just talk about what this person's about to say honey don't be that curious <laughs> don't be that curious always be patient always Always be patient. All right. And I'm talking somebody already fast forwarded this particular video and trying to to get what this person wants to say. Okay, who is the person who wants to say this at this point in time? Okay, so what's happening? What's going on? What's what 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 what? Most of the times when I'm given a prophetic word, I like to be ease. I like somebody to be ease. You know why? The word of God comes to give you peace. The word of God comes to give you hope. The word of God is life alone. The Bible says, for it is the spirit that gives life. The flesh profited nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. Know this and you're going to have peace. So every time a word has been ministered to you, know that this is my peace coming know that this is a change coming know that this is something amazing there's something wonderful coming my way god bless you in the mighty name of jesus amen there is somebody in your life and you've been with this particular person for a while now and you have a lot of goals that you want to meet up with you have a lot of pressing needs about your life you know i i i i, I was given a prophetic word and I spoke in that particular prophetic word that somebody's number one priority might be another person's number already have priority. So to one person, greatness is having a job. To another person, greatness is getting married. And to another person, greatness is having houses and all of that. So greatness and success and accomplishment and fulfillment is described in different ways according to our understanding so you have your own way of understanding and i have my own way of understanding and we all come together and we make the body of christ so there is somebody you've been with this particular person for a while now and you've been so worried now you're not desperate but you're just worried like how is this person taking me is this person even going to talk about the next step about this relationship is this person like how is this person treating me because the person is quiet the person doesn't talk about it the person stays quiet you know one of the things that gets um that can give frustration is if you're so much interested in something and then somebody's not talking about that particular thing you're interested in hmm. it's it's, it's just like you should remove it out of that person's mouth because sometimes you just want to know your stand sometimes you just want to know where you belong you just want to know your position you just want to know what should i be doing at this point in time do i move on do i just remove my mind and all of that but as it is you cannot force somebody you can only let people 
be the way they want to be so you've been with this particular person the person has been amazing the person has been wonderful but there is a stage where the amazingness doesn't move you anymore there's a stage where somebody keeps talking to you in words and it doesn't move you anymore you just want that person to pop the question you just want that person to go to a next level you just want that person to do something different no matter the love they're showing you you're like okay you've been showing me this can we go to the move to the next stage and all that and that is what i'm talking about right now somebody's about to do this to you and it has never happened they're about to ask you to marry them yes they're about to ask you to marry them and it has never happened and i hear somebody saying but pastor i'm not in a relationship now let me tell you something i've seen people who meet people even two months three months and they get married whoever is serious with you or whoever is serious in you would always want to take you to the next level there are people who can date for 10 years and don't get married no matter how they love each other it means that one or two of them are not serious but there is somebody who comes into your life it looks like you've known this person all your life they look at you they want to marry you they don't want to lose you and a whole lot and blah 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 and all that and this is about to happen you've been waiting and this is about to be asked to you it has never happened since you've been with this particular person you've never seen it manifest nothing 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 it's about to happen it's about to come true it's about to manifest you'll be so happy it's going to make you very happy i want to pray that let this plan be fulfilled i see somebody popping the question of will you marry me let it be fulfilled let it come true let it come true for you let it come true for you no attack in the name of jesus amen no attack no attack you're about to get married congratulations in the mighty name of jesus amen please if this word have been of great help to you i want to beg you to please pray for me as the spirit of the lord will lead you please do not forget to like do not forget to share and do not forget to subscribe wait a minute if you already haven't subscribed what are you really waiting for please kindly subscribe become an amazing part of this family god bless you and i love you already thank you so much for subscribing you mean so much to me god bless you in the mighty name of jesus amen now may the lord bless you may he keep you may he cause his face to shine on you may he be gracious to you and may he give you peace the shalom of the lord nothing missing nothing broken in the mighty name of jesus i love you so much i do i love you so much god bless you amazingly and god bless you abundantly if nobody ever tells you how much they love you i if i'm telling you right now that i love you so so much god bless you Shalom.